what is up guys Phoenix here and welcome back to the start of a new pixel tutorial so you guys have been bugging me for months to do the zero two from darling and the Franks so I've t I think I streamed it on um, the time lapse for you guys a few weeks ago um, and I'm feeling okay today so I figured I'll try and record one part or something see how that goes um, if you guys are watching this video that means the entire thing has been recorded so don't need to worry about me like disappearing um, I used to rec upload them without actually finishing the series and that would lead to problems so now I'm changing that method but let's get started with what we're gonna need the basics we're gonna have dirt and a block of coal to build the frame and that's probably all we're gonna need for the first few parts um, if you're trying to size things up I would suggest being on a flat world as you can see I'm only three above bedrock right here this is on creative mode uh, the size of the land is about 175 by 175 and we're gonna be starting on the left side of that plot so I'm not building from the center so um, basically if you did, were spacing this out, I'd have like 174 spaces to the right and about 175 going up. Also a disclaimer if you're new to this um, pixel arting, pixel arts typically end up being built on diagonals like this where the blocks don't typically connect. So if I do say things like up and to the left or up and to the right midway through the build, all that means is basically like let's say we have this vertical segment of three blocks like this and I want to keep going up I would say let's go up and to the left so what we do is switch to our placement block or our grass block and a placement block is a block that's just used to connect the blocks but is not actually a part of the art piece so if I say up and to the left you can place your placement block to the up or to the left and then we would use that to connect so if I say we're going up and to the left one block we would just do that and then you can delete the dirt blocks after it and you see it connects at the diagonal and then we could keep on working from there. So then from there I could say, oh, we're going up and to the left again, three vertical, and then we go one, two, three, just like that. And we would just keep on bridging the blocks. So um, that's my little disclaimer for you newbies out there. But those of us who are regulars in the pixel art community, let's jump right into it. And if you are new, make sure to take your time. I get a lot of messages of you guys spamming me saying, I'm doing it too quickly or whatever, and then it's your first build on the channel ever. If this is your first time on the channel, um, take it slowly and you will be able to build hopefully so starting off from our plot of land we're gonna go 10 placement blocks up into the air first so not coal but 10 placement one two three four five six seven eight nine ten just like that and above those 10 placement blocks we're gonna start our first coal just like that now actually if you wanted to you could you can actually extend this to the ground with um, with coal I just haven't done that yet so let's actually do that so let's put the 10 below it with coal so my bad so instead of just having the 10 placement blocks this is actually going to be an 11 high tower of coal to start because we had the 10 placement blocks plus the one coal on top so this converts to 11 so make sure you count that out before continuing sorry about that from this top block right here we're gonna go directly to the right of it and we're gonna actually put six pieces of coal to the right one two three four five six from there we're gonna go up and to the right five flat so this is our first diagonal segment we're gonna put our placement block to the top or to the right hence the term up and to the right and then we're gonna go five flat one two three four five up into the right three flat so place them block to the top or right side one two three and from this three flat segment we have right here we're gonna go to the final block in it so this one right here and we're gonna put one coal underneath it and then we're gonna split into two different directions so what we're gonna do to help us with this is on this one underneath we just placed let's put an extra placement block below it like so and from that extra placement block we're gonna put one coal to the left and then we're going to put six coal to the right of it. So one, two, three, four, five, six. Perfect. Now in the first part of every tutorial, as you'll see on the channel, I like to get the left to the right shoulder done just so I can space out how much of it fits onto the cameraman. And then we do the height and the rest of the outline and then eventually the details. So I might skip some portions and then come back to it. And when we are ready to skip portions of the build that I know I'll come back to later, what I typically do is I'll mark that block with a dirt block. So on this single we have on the left right here, we're going to mark this with a dirt block. This is just going to be some details on her jacket that I'll come back to later. Um, 
It probably would only take me a minute to finish it right now, but like I said, I want to reach that shoulder, and I usually only record for 15 to 20 minutes to keep my, my brain healthy. Anyways, from this six flat over here on the right side, we're going to add a placement block to the right or top side, like so, and go up into the right two flat, one, two. Then from that two flat, we're going to go to this right block right here, and we're going to do two things. First, we're going to put an extra two blocks below it, one, two, and then mark those two blocks, one, two. So now we have two sets of blocks being marked, the two vertical right here, and then the one single over there. Then going back up to this block on the right that we had in the two flat, we're gonna go up into the right one single from it, up into the right five flat, placement block, one, two, three, four, five, up into the right seven flat, so placement block, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And unless I specify that we're working from like, let's say the center block or something, you could always just assume that I'm going to the end of what we just placed before placing my next placement block. So we're gonna go up into the right seven flat again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And then we go back and delete our old placement blocks. The healthy way to practice the build. Uh, up into the right four flat. One, two, three, four. And then up into the right two flat two times in a row. So placing blocks to the top or right side. One, two, that's one. Placing block again. One, two, that's two. Perfect. Now from there, what we're going to do is go to this second set of two flat or the one that's higher up. And we're going to go to the right block in it, actually. And we're going to put six pieces of placement block to the right. So one, two, three, four, five, six. And then we're gonna follow that up with one coal. Just like that. So now we just have this suspended coal in the air. From that suspended suspended block of coal, what we're going to do is we're going to add four to the top of it. One, two, three, four, and then 10 below it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. Perfect. And if you were to count this out carefully, it should be 15 in total. So let me just double check. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Perfect. I'm not going to always double check everything like this, but some of these bigger numbers are important. And especially because this block is floating by itself, connected to nothing, I have nothing to check if I did it correctly. Um, what we can kind of check to do what we did correctly again, besides counting, is from the bottom half right here. Uh, we're going to go down into the right eight vertical, and that should touch the ground. So since I said down into the right, from this bottom block, we're going to put a placement block to the down or to the right. <laughs> and let's go down into the right eight vertical. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. And it touched the ground. So that's a little bit of a good indicator that we've, we're doing things correctly in case you need to kind of um, see if you're doing it right or not. Anyways, I also haven't deleted this six flat we had that connected us to it. And that's because this original two flat over here that, that we used to connect is actually going to be bridged up to do some of her hair and stuff. So before deleting this six flat, let's mark this right block into two flat with a piece of coal, I mean, with a piece of dirt, so that we know to come back to it later when we're doing the hair. And then we can go and delete these six. So one, two, three, four, five, six. Let me just give it a little bit of a save Z. I, I promise I'll never say save Z again. <laughs> that was cringe. <laughs> all right. Anyways, from the 15 vertical we have right there, we're going to go all the way to the top block and put a placement block on top so that we can go up and to the right three singles. One, two, three. From there, we're gonna go up and to the right, two vertical, three times in a row. Let's place and block on the top side. One, two, that's one. Place and block again. One, two, that's two. And I said three, so let's go again. One, two, that's three. And if I zoom out, you can see we have this three singles followed by three sets of two vertical, just like that. And at any point, if you feel like you're lost or confused, just always look over at my right hand screen and you can see if yours looks like mine. And if it doesn't, yikes, yikes, dude get that checked out anyways from there we're gonna go up into the right four vertical so placing block to the top one two three four up into the right six vertical 
one, two, three, four, five, six. And from this six vertical, what we can actually do is starting from the top, let's count down three blocks. One, two, three. And I want to say this is supposed to be a light gray block we're putting to the right, but I can, it, it'll probably change later if I find out I said it wrong. So let's switch to light gray concrete and put one to the right, right there. And then mark it. Um, this is supposed to be shading that's done on the collar of her neck. I don't know what color specifically I did the shading with. It might be light gray, it might be a darker gray. I'll go over that later, but for now we're just going to mark it um, so that we have it there as an indicator that there is shading going to be there. All right, and then once we're done with that block being marked, you can delete these three vertical dirts and go to the top of this six. All right, because we're not doing the shading yet, we're just going to go to the top of this six now and continue. All right, from there we're going to go up into the right six vertical vertical again. So placement block one, two, three, four, five, six up into the right one single up into the right three flat one two three and from this three flat what we're going to do actually is we're gonna to go to the block all the way on the right right here and from this third block so just one all the way on the end we're gonna put three on top one two three and then below it we're gonna put another five going straight down one two three four five Perfect. So once you have this little teeter-totter of shape right here, uh, you can mark the top half of it because we can continue with that later and do the chin and stuff. But the bottom half where we had the five dangling below, what I want you to do is starting from the bottom, we're gonna count up three blocks. So one, two, three. And on that third block, we're just gonna put one piece of coal to the left, like so. Then we're gonna continue falling back to the bottom and putting a block down into the right three single one two three I'm proud of myself for not making a started from the bottom now we're here joke but um only half of you guys probably would have gotten that when I when I just said starting from the bottom <laughs> the other half is like what is he talking about but it, it's okay it's okay that's what we do on this channel um, let me move the cameraman a little bit because we're seeing that we're running out of space this is why in the first part of every video I like to see how much um, the left to right of the build looks so that way for every other part of the tutorial at least the cameraman um, will have everything in frame and as you can see we ran out of space on the cameraman and we aren't even halfway done with the um, we're not even at the midpoint yet you would want the midpoint to be at the middle part of the cameraman so I fixed that anyway some of these three singles we have we're gonna continue going down into the right until I switch otherwise so pretty much for this next segment um, as I say things, you can keep on putting your placement blocks to the bottom or right side each time that we're done, and you should be safe until I switch up otherwise. So from here, we're going to go down into the right two flat three times in a row. So placement block one, two, that's one. Let's do it again. One, two, that's two. And then finally, one, two, that's three. Let's zoom out so you can see it. All connected at the diagonal. Let's go and delete these dirt. So delete, delete, delete down into the right two singles one whoops one two down into the right two flat and we're gonna do this five times in a row so one two that's one one two that's two one two that's three one two that's four and finally one two that's five let's delete these dirt blocks again from there we're gonna get ready to descend down and dip into the collar so we're going to go down into the right three singles a third time. Actually, not a third time. It's another time. So one, two, three, like so. And I didn't use the placement blocks for that, but I encourage you to do it um, just so that you don't get confused by doubling up with the coals. I strongly can, um, you, uh, encourage you guys to always use your placement blocks unless you're uh, a veteran. Anyways, from here, we're going to go down to right four vertical. So placement, placement block on the bottom or right side. One, two, three, four down into the right five vertical one two three four five down to right four vertical one two three four and from the four vertical we can actually kind of set up markers for the shading um, so what we're gonna do is go to the second to last block from the bottom and on the left side we're gonna put two pieces of light gray one two and on the right side we're gonna put three 
one, two, three, and we can mark those. So if we wanted to do the shading, this two flat would eventually go and meet up with that single we had waiting for it over there. And then this three flat, we didn't do the right side of the body yet, so it has nothing to connect with, and that's okay. But what we're gonna do is rise up to the top part of this four vertical right here, and put a placement block on top, so that we can go up and to the right, four vertical, one, two, three, four. Uh, let me just make sure that my voice is recording right now. It is, okay, that's good. From that four vertical, we're gonna go up and to the right, two vertical, three times in a row. So placement block, one, two, that's one. One, two, that's two. One, two, that's three. So we went up and to the right, two vertical, three times in a row. Zoom out so you can see. So from this start of the slant, we have four, four, two, two, two. And like I said, we were gonna keep putting our placing blocks to the bottom or the right until we switched direction and that kind of changed right here when we came back up. So you, you, you can keep putting your placing block to the right side each time and you should be fine or the top until we change direction again. So from here, we're gonna go up and to the right one single and then placement block. Up and to the right two flat, one, two, placement block. Up and to the right three flat, two times in a row. One, two, three, that's one. One, two, three, that's two. Up and to the right two flat. One, two. Up and to the right four flat. One, two, three, four. Up and to the right two flat. One, two. Up and to the right one single. And if you look at the right hand camera screen, you can see the shape is starting to kind of mimic what we had on the left side. Um, this is the collar of her neck or whatever, and then it's going to dip back down into her shoulder. So everything is looking good from the right-hand screen. I don't know about exact measurements. We might be one block off. We'll find out at the end. Um, from this single, we're going to put a placement block again so we can go up and to the right two flat, two times in a row. One, two, that's one. One, two, that's two. Up and to the right three singles. One, two, three. Up and to the right four vertical, so placement block on the top or right side, and we're gonna go straight up now. One, two, three, four. And from this four vertical, we're gonna go to this second to last block from the top and put one cold to the right, like this. And then we're gonna go to the last block and put a piece of uh, placement block on top so we can go up and to the right, six vertical. One, two, three, four, five, six. And kind of like what we did on the left side where we have that block just marked at the top. Um, to continue into the chin and stuff. We're gonna do that on this six vertical. We're gonna go to the block all the way on the top and mark it, because we'll come back to it later. But then we're gonna drop down to the bottom of the six vertical and this second to last block from the bottom, so this one right here, is what we're gonna want to work with next. We're gonna put one coal to the right of it. And we're gonna use that one coal to the right to extend back down and hopefully complete her shoulder. So let's go down into the right from here, which means we're gonna put a placement block to the bottom or right side and we're gonna go down into the right 19 vertical. So count this very carefully. Uh, maybe two groups, you can do a group of 10 and a group of nine, or you can just count it very slowly, but I'll do 10 to nine. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, and then nine more to make the 19. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Perfect. From this 19 vertical, we're gonna go down into the right three vertical. One, two, three. Down into the right two vertical. One, two. Down into the right one single. And this is going on a little bit longer than I preferred it to. I think we already passed the 15 minute mark, but I want to make sure we finish the right shoulder. So you guys are getting a lot more than usual in this build, which means the next part should be a lot easier. Anyways. From that single, we're gonna go down into the right six flat. So place them locked to the bottom or right side. One, two, three, four, five, six. And I think the reason I built this, even though I don't watch this show, was because of the fact that it was so simple for me to do. Um, so I don't think at any point this should be super, super difficult for anybody, which is fine. From the six flat we just created, we're gonna go down into the right two flat, two times in a row. So place them locked to the bottom or right side. One, two, that's one. 
one, two, that's two, and then delete these extra dirts. From this bottom set of two flats, so this one all the way on the right, we're gonna add an extra block to the right of this final block, and then we're gonna add an extra block to the bottom of it as well, creating this weird T shape. We're gonna mark this bottom block that we put in the middle right here, and come back to it later. But from this block all the way on the right that we added, we're gonna go down into the right from it, 12 vertical. So place some block to the right or bottom. And we're gonna do 12 vertical, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12. And from the 12 vertical, starting from the top, let's count down three blocks. So one, two, three, and from that third block, we're then going to add six pieces of dirt to the right. One, two, three, four, five, six. Kind of like what we did on the left side where we had this floating dis um, disjointed segment for the hair. We need to do that on the right side of the head as well. Well, So after those six pieces of dirt, we're going to put two pieces of coal to the right. One, two, just like that. From those two pieces of coal that we've now created a flat with, we're gonna mark the left block in it because we do need to extend it all the way to the ground and then back up. Um, but I'm not gonna do that today. Instead, what we're gonna do is go to this right block right here and go down into the right three flat. One, two, three. Down into the right two flat. One, two. Down into the right five flat. One, two, three, four, five. And you can just keep putting your placement block to the right each time you should be fine or the bottom uh, down into the right three flat again so the number is going to stay small and consistent one two three we're just rounding out her shoulder down into the right four flat one two three four down to right three flat three times in a row one two three that's one place some blocks to the bottom or right side one two three that's two one two three that's three perfect And then finally, this final segment, we're just gonna go down into the right six flat. One, two, three, four, five, six. Down into the right four flat. One, two, three, four. And then from the right block in that four flat, we're gonna go all the way to the end right here. And just like we did on the left side, we can extend it to the ground and it should work if we extend it down six blocks. So let's see if it reaches the ground with six more blocks. One, two, three, four, five and six and it did so that means we are perfectly in um the right spot which is good oh i messed up the cameraman all right i'm gonna fix that for the next part but it fits all in frame which is good hopefully you guys did enjoy this first part of the build we have a lot more detail to get through which is the face the chin and then also like she has these little shoulder strap thingies as well but we'll get through all of that um this was just the first part hopefully you guys did enjoy and if you did be sure to like and subscribe for more pixel art content this is Phoenix, and as always, I'll see you guys later.